<clears throat> hey guys, welcome to a brand new video. This is my review for the Bournemouth vs Leeds United game. I'm so happy. I don't know, what can I say about it? Pathetic. Pathetic performance. No one cares out there. The only players I saw care out there, Somerville, thought he had a decent performance and he was running for the team. Nonto, great balling, great assist. And he did well and tried to set up some stuff. Um, <clears throat> I think Harrison was all right. I don't think he was great, but I think he was all right. Bamford, with his goal, did well, got the header on. And not only that, I think he had a decent performance all around, trying to hold up the ball and trying to help the team out. I think they did well. I think the the front four did well, is what I'm saying. The front four did well in Somerville, Nonto, Harrison, Bamford. Those four did deep, good performances, in my opinion. Good, not great performance, not good. But actually, goes good performance. Good performance for the way we played, because it was absolute shit. Um, what can I say? The first goal, like the way we conceded our goals, the first one, Cooper does a nice block, and then, yeah, the rebound, bang, goal, 1 0. We legit, we, we let, we let Lerma score twice. Two goals against us. You know, they went 2 0 up, and we're thinking, in my opinion, well, I was thinking, oh no, it's over, we need a goal of half time to bring this back. In steps Nonto, ball whipped in, lovely header from Bamford, 2-1. I'm like, yes, we're about, oh, sorry. I'm like, yes, we're back into it, and we can get back into this game um, and hopefully win it. Um, we go into the break, nothing else happened. Um, we go into the break um, at the score of 2-1 still. Yep, still 2-1 at the break, and I thought we were going to have a good second half, turn it around and have a, you know, play well in the second half. The complete opposite happened. You know, they played better. They had six shots on target. Six shots and scored four. Six shots on target and scored four. That, that hurts for me. 16 shots on target, they scored four. Like, Rasmus got beat so many times. I don't want Rasmus on the pitch. What did Furpo do to get dropped? What has Furpo done wrong to get dropped for this match? Can we, can, um, can someone explain what he did wrong? Um, we tried to turn the game around after it was too late, really. The third, I think it was the third goal, the one where Robin Cock, they're through, and then the ball's in the middle, Cock could clear it, he gets his foot to it, I didn't really see it, I saw the replay, because my internet turned off at the time, but he got his foot to it, and then they, they just hit it in the back of the net, Cock could have done better there, in my opinion, and actually got the ball out of there, um, but yeah, the players, pathetic, hold their heads in shame at the end. Play, apparently, what I heard on, saw on Twitter was some players were in tears. I think it was Somerville, Nonto, Bamford, Rodrigo. You know, the only they're the only four I saw care today. And, of course, Cooper and Voba. Cooper always cares. Voba always cares. You could tell. Bamford cared out there and tried his best. Nonto tried his best because you could see it. He cared. Somerville put in a lot of, you know, he's, he was running and trying to help us on the attack, doing well. Harrison... Wasn't a great game, I would say, but he he kept trying and trying and trying, and that's all we really asked for as a lead, as Leeds fans is someone that keeps on trying, keeps on going for it. Rocker, there was a moment where he spun out of like three people. I'm like, yes, but then he's just spin. So then he just spins back into the defenders and loses the ball. I didn't think he had a good game. I didn't think McKenney had a good game. Rasmus was the worst player on the pitch. Oh, actually, no, no, he wasn't. He was the second worst player on the pitch. Um. <clears throat> Cooper was good, and then he had to come off due to injury, and then Voba came on. Voba did he, you know, did good in my opinion. Um, having if Cooper's out for the season, oh my god, we need Cooper and Voba together. Since Cooper got injured and Voba came on, can we talk about that? Why not play both of them? Cox not good. Cox had a poor performance. Ailing was all right. He tried. I saw Ailing tried. He, he's another one that looked like he cared. He tried out there. Melier, can we talk about Melier, please? Oh my god, the second goal. He palms it straight to him. He palms it straight to him. He palms, it, he palms and he goes, there you go, score. And then I think it was the, yeah, the fourth goal. The shot's like almost right at him. Goes for the save. Hits his, hits his wrist, hits his hand and just rolls in the back of the net somehow still. Melia can't be dropped because the rest of them aren't good enough. But Melia's performances have been poor. But, like, we can't do anything. So, for me, we've got Man City now because I think we're down already and I think we're already relegated, which, you know, shocking. I think it's all over and I think we're playing championship football next season. I've got no hope in this team. They don't have fight. The only hope I have is the other teams to do the job and for everyone below us to lose every single game, which won't happen because Everton and Leicester play each other. 
So we uh, we got to hope that ends in a draw, and then the, all those teams lose the rest of their games, which won't happen, and we are going to get relegated. In my opinion, a lot of people's opinion already can already say we are down, and I'm going to say for the first time this season, I've said this, we are down. Hello, Championship next season! Thanks for watching the video. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I, I know it's hard to like the video. Just like the video. Uh, all of our pains can go away, maybe. Subscribe if you are new um, for more content that could help you through this Leeds depression. Because that's what it is. Leeds depression. Oh my god, I can't handle this anymore. But thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next time. Peace!